yeah, we're back. Sorry, it's been so long. We've just been doing family time with my nephews. But tonight we're having pork chops with my pork strapped raw BBQ flavored pork ribs or wines, however you want to call them. Get a handful like this. You have a blender, put them in a blender. If you don't, put them in a bag like this. Close it up like this. And spit them. Stick your anger out on them. But make sure you don't pop the bag when you do it. I'm gonna need a little more, I think. Yeah. Another handful. Make sure you get the air out of the bag when you do it. Hey, baby, you going to come on help mommy? Beat them up, beat them up, beat them up. Some big ones, that's fine. You just want an, them fine enough that they will coat your pork chops. And you can use chicken if you don't want pork chops. And you can do this with almost any kind of meat. Okay. Hi, baby. You can help my mom make dinner tonight. Get your plate out and your room room for you. Like I said, you didn't have anything ready. <laughs> yeah. Okay, go ahead. Get your barbecue sauce We're using the street baby way honey kind. You can use any kind that you like, your favorite kind. Put it in the bag of Crossed up food. <laughs> Thank you, honey. Sorry about that. My barbecue sauce is going low. So I have to get the new one out tonight. Barbecue sauce in there. Hey, baby, you can Let me don't want this to fall on you. Okay, get your pork chops. Or if you don't like pork chops, you're taking whatever you're using. And throw them in. And throw them in. Get your barbecue and put more on top. Just a little bit. No, don't eat too much. Go ahead. Then get your tronchos. Break up the bag. Not like me, break it over the other bag. So we mama a pork rinds on the bottom, Dorito broken up on top, and honey barbecue. Just for the reminders of what I'm doing here. Close the bag like this and stick it up. Get it all over your meat. All over your meat. Make sure it gets 
all over. And if you want to marinate it, you can, but you don't have to because the barbecue is going to get into the meat and pork rinds and everything is going to flavor it. And then put your meat down like this. Get your other piece of meat. Put it down like this. And then get your hands a little dirty, people. Don't worry about getting your hands dirty. Getting your hands dirty is yummy food. That's what it's going to make this. Good and yummy. Okay, I'll be right back. I'm going to wash my hands before I show you how to do the sides. All right, go ahead. Get your mushrooms. That's going to be our side tonight. Open them up. Get a handful. Actually, get them all. Get them all. Put them on top of your food right like this. Yummy. This is going to be so good tonight. The meat is going to marinate the mushrooms some. It's going to be good. Get your sweet onion sauce. And a little bit on top of the mushrooms. Just like that. Now put it in your oven at 350 for 35 minutes. And then chalk it. If the meat needs a couple more minutes, then you can add more time. I'm doing mine in the air fryer. You can do it in the oven too. Thank you for your time. We'll be back to taste it when it's done.